Hey everyone and welcome back! In today's episode we're adding an IKEA door and window sensor to Home Assistant. This sensor uses Zigbee and I'll be pairing it with a ZHA integration. The steps I'm about to show you apply to most Zigbee sensors, so even if you have a different brand, the process will be very similar. But don't forget to buy AAA batteries, the product doesn't have the batteries included. So let's have a look at our sensor. It's on my screen right now. Uh, all we need to do is find a small reset button. In this case, we need to take off the lid, as you can see in this image. And then we can see the reset button. Don't press it yet. Uh, we'll head on to Home Assistant and I'll show you how to integrate. Now, in Home Assistant, we need to follow these steps. We need to go to Settings, Devices and Services. We go to Add Integration, but before we press that button, we need to put our device into pairing mode. Most of the devices uh, get into pairing mode by pressing and holding the button for a few seconds. In the IKEA door and window sensor case, we need to press the reset button for four times and then it will get to pairing mode. So let's do that now. Add Integration, Add Zigbee Device, and I'm pressing it now four times. One, two, three, four. There it is. We wait until it's found. And now it's an important step. What we need to do is always give it a name that we know where to find it, uh, the area. So let's say if you use it on your front door, just give it a name like a front door sensor or something like that. Now the device is ready to use. All we need to do is change the name. I will delete this section here and I will write back door. That's what I'm going to use it for. Give it a name so you know where to find it. And that's it. Just go back and we have our sensor. So let's check the sensor status now. So if for some reason you, you went out of the uh, menu I had before, we can go back to it and just check the, the sensor. We can add it to a dashboard and see how it works. You go to settings, devices and services, and we find Zigbee Home Automation, ZHA. We press on the devices and we look for our sensor. This is the backdoor sensor. And now let's add it to the dashboard. It has the option here, just add it to the dashboard. And I made a custom dashboard for our uh, tutorials. I need to find it here, tutorial dashboard next and add to dashboard now i can find it here and here's my backdoor sensor now i'm gonna open it you see it's going to open now i'm gonna close all you need to do is uh, put this sensor on your door and uh, you can use it in a lot of automations for instance you can use it for turning on a light or maybe you have an uh, siren in your house and uh, maybe you want to use it for security purposes and then when somebody opens the door in the nighttime or uh, whatever just uh, have an alarm sound when the door opens and that's it it's simple and effective if you found this video helpful don't forget to like subscribe and comment below with your ideas for smart automation see you in the next episode